A new paper by the Harvard University expert, Avi Loeb, asks the question, is the interstellar object Free Eye Atlas, is this an alien technology? The researchers write that at this early stage of its passage through our solar system, Free Eye Atlas, the recently discovered interstellar interloper, has displayed various anomalous characteristics determined by photometric and astrometric observations. And the researchers suggest that this asteroid could be a technological hostility. The object flies surprisingly close to Venus, Mars and Jupiter. This low retrograde tilt of Free Eye Atlas's orbital plane to the ecliptic, this offers various benefits to an extraterrestrial intelligence, since this allows the object access to our planet with relative impunity. The eclipse by the Sun from Earth of Free Eye Atlas at perihelion would allow it to conduct a clandestine reverse solar or berth manoeuvre, an optical high thrust strategy for interstellar spacecraft to break and stay bound to the Sun. An optical intercept of planet Earth would entail an arrival in late November or early December of this year, and also a non-gravitational acceleration normalised at one astronomical unit from the Sun would indicate an intent to intercept the planet Jupiter not far off its path and a strategy to rendezvous with it after perihelion. And there are certain characteristics of this object that make it an alien probe and this has astronomers suspiciously observing. Just like a Moor Moor, Free Eye Atlas appears to be deviating slightly from the expected path predicted by gravity alone. While solar radiation pressure or outgassing could cause this, Avi Loeb argues the lack of visible jets or typical dust tails, this challenges the conventional comet hypothesis. He examines whether the object's brightness is consistent with what would be expected from an ordinary comet nucleus, and he also notes over-reflectivity, suggesting a metallic, engineered surface. Preliminary photometric data, this points towards an unusual rotational behaviour, potentially suggesting a flat, reflective surface, a feature that Avi Loeb previously argued could indicate a light sail, similar to what human beings have begun experimenting with through breakthrough star shots. When natural explanations strain under the weight of evidence, technological explanations should not be ruled out. These Harvard experts and Cambridge researchers, they propose that Free Eye Atlas may be an extraterrestrial probe, either operational or defunct, and it was sent to observe or scan the inner solar system. He draws parallels with von Neumann probes, self-replicating interstellar machines theorised by physicists to be capable of exploring galaxies autonomously. If the Eye Atlas is such a device, its trajectory might have been intentional, possibly altered by onboard navigation or initial propulsion systems. And remember guys, ignoring anomalies simply because they challenge paradigms is anti-ethical to scientific inquiry. There is a need for open-mindedness and instrumental investigation. For instance, sending spacecraft to intercept such an object, or designing early warning systems that can prepare for their arrival. Whether or not Free Eye Atlas is of alien origins, Avi Loeb's paper serves as a catalyst for a bold new direction in astrophysics, what he calls space archaeology. This discipline would not involve just observing the skies for distant signals, as the search for extraterrestrial intelligence does, SETI, but actively hunting for physical artefacts in the solar system that may drift into our cosmic neighbourhood. If Free Eye Atlas turned out to be artificial, then it would confirm that we are not alone and that other civilizations may be, or may have been, capable of interstellar travel. In the words of Avi Loeb, if we dare to look, we might find that the universe 
has already sent us a postcard. <laughs>